So this is how you use the LUT in DaVinci Resolve. So the first thing you'll need to do is you'll need to install the LUT, bring it into DaVinci Resolve. So you do that by clicking the gear, not glia, gear icon down at the bottom right. And then you go into the color management tab and then click this button here that says open LUT folder. And then you basically place the LUT, the .cube file into this folder or into a subfolder if you want to stay organized. And then once you've done that, you click the update lists and then it should update the um, the list and then um, it'll have installed the LUT. So save those and then we'll jump in to how I actually use the LUT. So I've got a couple of clips here that are ready for grading so I can show you um, the LUT in action. So I'm going to select this one and then I'm going to go to the color tab at the bottom and then you should just have a node ready to go. So just right click that and then go down to LUT and then find where you place the LUT and select it. And then boom, you've applied the LUT. Always keep the LUT node as the last node. So that is the last thing that happens to your footage before um, before you export it. So what I mean by this is if you want to change the exposure, do it in a node before the LUT. Same with balancing color, with color balance or anything like that, do it before the LUT. And then that is pretty much it. This is how I tweak it. I'll just make my adjustments um, before the LUT and then yeah, good to go. A good tip is though, this is how I'll sometimes do it depending on the project, depends how quick I need to need to work. But if I go to the effects tab um, and then bring in an adjustment clip and place it over my clips, you can go into the color tab again and make sure you're selecting the adjustment clip and load the LUT up like we just did, but on the adjustment clip. So if we look at our timeline now, all of the clips underneath have the LUT applied to them because that's what the adjustment layer clip is doing. So I hope this video has been helpful and gives you a bit of an insight to how I work. Um, and if you have any questions, just drop me an email and I'll answer them right away. And I hope the rest of your day is brilliant.